where you can travel the world in a matter of minutes. But in Las Vegas this week, they're also pushing the message that you can take the internet with you wherever you go, even in a moving car. The main purpose of the product is to keep kids occupied while they're in the backseat on long trips with parents, uh, but it also the product also works to envelop the car in a Wi-Fi hotspot. The internet's arriving in this car via a mobile phone signal. It means parents can surf the web while the children watch live TV. But who needs to be online all the time? I myself, if I go somewhere and I don't have an internet connection, I need like an anxiety medicine. I, I, can't, I can't stand it. The big electronics firms are all betting that millions of us share this desire to be connected everywhere. The battle is on between a whole range of devices aiming to get you on the internet wherever you are. Not just fancy new mobile phones, but a whole range of mini computers like this one and this one and this one. There's also a battle between the different wireless technologies which will put you on the internet. One, two, three, go! Inside the Consumer Electronics Show, this stand is promoting something called WiMAX. Build as the technology which takes Wi-Fi from the wireless hotspot to a whole town. Many devices which use WiMAX are now coming out, but customers could be confused. So the key here is going to be making it simple, making it priced so that a consumer can afford it. And if the consumer can see an easy path to get what they want, they'll probably follow it. If they just see an acronym soup, uh, they're going to have a great deal of difficulty picking the technology that they want. Wi-Fi, WiMAX, 3G, the mobile internet is full of those bewildering acronyms. And surfing on the move can be a very expensive hobby. So it may be a while yet before more of us take it for granted that we can get online anytime, anywhere. Rory Kathleen Jones, BBC News, Las Vegas.